What's happening guys, my name is Amit and in this video I'm going to show you how to install the nameless ROM on the Samsung Galaxy SL i9003. Well, to be able to correctly install the nameless ROM, I suggest installing the CyanogenMod 11 KitKat ROM as base. I'm currently running the CM11 ROM as you can see. If you need to know how to install this ROM, please follow the video link on your screen now. The first thing that we need to do is download the nameless ROM file and its corresponding GAPS file from the links mentioned in the description box below and save it onto your external SD card. Once you're on CM11, reboot your device into the recovery mode as I'm doing right now. You could also use the button combination method if you'd like to. Once in recovery, head on to Wipe Data Factory Reset and select Yes. Next, select uh, Wipe Cache Partition and hit Yes. And finally, head on to Advanced and select Wipe Dalvik Cache and hit Yes. That's it. Now go back and select Install Zip from SD Card, choose Zip from SD Card and locate the nameless ROM folder that you saved onto the external SD Card earlier. Select the nameless ROM file and hit Yes. Now this process may take a little while to complete, so make sure you do not touch or press any other buttons on your device. After this completes, head on to the same folder and install the GAPS file in the same way. Once the installation of the GAPS file is done, go back and reboot your device. Now this time around you would be able to see a new boot animation on your screen indicating that the nameless ROM has been successfully installed. Please note this boot animation may remain on your screen for a very long amount of time and it may seem that the device is stuck or is not doing anything. Don't worry, this is normal, just let it be until it brings up the uh, setup page for you. Once you get the setup page, you can install your preferences and set it up according to your requirements. That's it, you would now have the latest nameless ROM build running on your device. I would like to mention that all these custom ROMs that we get on this device are courtesy Dheeraj from XDA Developers and would like to extend a special thank you for him. Please find all the links and a text tutorial of this installation on our website, links to which are mentioned in the description box below. I hope this video was useful to you. Please hit like if it was and don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more such videos. Till then, cheers.